In truth, I cannot tell how much time has passed since I sent that letter. Greetings and hallucinations, ladies and lads. I am Chancellor of the Harmonious Frequencies of the Mighty Empire of Onion, and this is Darkest Dungeon. They made a tonic. By accident, an enterprising charlatan brewed an actual potent draft, drought, drought, made from uh, dust harvested from the comet. It can work wonders for a price. 30 crystals, we only have 11 shards. 30. Cures one disease for every hero on the roster. No big deal. Who cares? I don't need it. It's fine. Whatever. Uh, yeah. Ednell uh, has enlightened now. Will only meditate for stress relief after meditating for stress relief. Okay. I mean, you did it once, but does that mean you have to do it all the time? I guess so. I guess it does. We cured scurvy from Pinel. And we got rid of weak grip Auto automaton of phobia and ashen negative quirks. Ablin returned from their search for holy meaning, so he's back this week. Torleville drank, and Lue also drank. Harcourt, Farriers, and Eid are all champions now, level 5, which is exactly what we went in for. Well, actually, we went in to get an invitation for the courtyard and failed, but we did get the level up, so it was at least a half a win. Not bad. Can't be on you, calm down. You probably won't be going on the next one because I think we're headed into the farmstead this week. See if there's anybody worth getting a bounty hunter. Fine. I'll take you. The thrill of the hunt. That's right. The promise of payment. I don't love that he's only level three, but uh, that seems to be the highest that we've gotten in in a while, and we're we've been fully leveled up for a long time. This uh, series has gone on a lot longer than I expected it to. Something like 40, either 30 or 40 weeks more than the vanilla playthrough, which I guess is to be expected since there's two full dungeons. Uh, I'll keep this in mind. We have a Flagellant and a Hellion in here. Uh, I think we only need one Hellion as a mercenary. The Highwayman we already have as well, so the Flagellant is the only one that I might be taking. I definitely won't be taking an Antiquarian, I wouldn't imagine. Let's treat barriers of his disease. Anyway, get that out of the way. I don't remember anybody having hardly any stress from last time. No, they all look pretty clean. And diseases as well seem to be non-existent besides that one. Wonderful. Okay. So yeah, let's try to uh, kill the sleeper this time. That's going to be my goal. You know what, though? We're only four deeds away from having the the last building, right? For, for deeds. Where is that at? Here. Uh, for Crusader Vestals and Flagellants. Stun and healing skills. Stun resist and healing skills. Yeah, let's do it. Uh, busts, we're going to turn in three. For two. Perfect. And then uh, crests will turn in enough for two. Perfect. I did the wrong thing. Did I? Oh, I did. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. For deeds, right? Deeds. Wait. We did 12. 12 crests would have been two deeds. But I turned... Oh no, I was looking at the wrong thing, though. I think deeds were up here, and I was looking at the wrong thing. It probably came out to three already. Yeah. I just thought if I traded a bunch of uh, heirlooms for a second that we would get an increase, but that shouldn't be the way that it is. I imagine that it isn't that way, as a matter of fact. Uh, let's see. The Altar of Light. Done. Amazing. It's beautiful. I never really fully appreciated the artwork that goes along with these buildings, honestly. That's very cool. I like that. It all feels very Halloween-y with the colors, and that almost looks like a pumpkin to me. I guess it could also look like an Easter egg in the right light, but uh, yeah. 
I don't know why it would have to be hol uh, holiday themed, but whatever. Training grounds, yep. Yeah. Of course, this is an at at Athenium, Athenaeum, maybe. Not sure. Yeah, it all looks very cool. Oh, the Sanguine Vintners, of course, looks the way that it should. <laughs> Absolutely. The Puppet Theater as well. Amazing. Ah. Gotta love the art style in this game. It's so good. Okay. Uh, this is gonna be a long one, so let's get to it. 71 foes reaped the last time. We're looking to do 72 as we reap the sleeper this time. I definitely want to take a Vestal, so we'll keep that in mind. And then a Jester would be kind of nice, but, um, yeah, Highwaymen do more damage. Hellions as well can attack all positions. Uh, Bounty Hunters have their place, so we'll think about that too. And I'll try to build a party that's different from the last one. Well, here's one I'm not sure about. Obviously, he's not a mercenary, but I'm pretty sure the last time we took a non-mercenary character into the farmstead, they still returned uh, after the week was over or whatever. I don't think that that's um, restricted to them, but you see 10% shard loot taken. I think that means that we pay them 10% uh, of our shards to go. Hero will only undertake endless harvest quests and farmstead does not take up a roster spot. Max 6. Yeah, so I think the only benefit to them really is that we can have extras of them. And actually it would probably be uh, more lucrative for us if we didn't take them. But that's whatever. Yeah, it'll be fine. Hopefully she gets one of these two replaced because they're completely irrelevant to her. But whatever. Okay. Uh, yeah. Inferno Paradise, though. Sounds pretty cool, I have to admit. I'm kind of excited to see what happens with this one. And, yeah, I guess I guess if the characters die, they do still lose their trinkets. So I have to keep that in mind. Uh, but everything else, I mean, we should be all right. We'll take this for the increase to stun resist. Hang on now. I feel like we are missing some things. No, oh, those aren't the things that I thought that we were missing, but that's fine. Uh, we'll take that for the increased health. And then what else could we do? Something with, uh, with an increase to damage would be great. We don't need to worry about scouting or trap disarm. Sun resist, I might save for one of the healers, but we'll see how it goes. They're not unholy, so we don't need that. I thought there was something... Yeah, here. Crit for melee and damage for melee skills. That should all work very nicely. He, of course, has the Crusader trinket, so we want to try to make sure that he doesn't die. I was considering even bringing the cursed uh, Crusader, but I feel like that's kind of irrelevant. Um, we could put him into Bloodlust and get some extra damage and stuff out. Uh, with him, but I think this will be fine. So increase to healing and stress skills, I don't care much about, but the increase to protection, move, resist, uh, reduce stress, and max HP increase are all incredibly good. Uh, healing and stress skills, we could still take this since I don't have a Jester in the in the team, and that would make this more efficacious. Is that word applicable to this? Uh, scenario maybe zealous accusation and smite though i think are going to be fine it would be kind of nice to have stunning blow to get a stun off but i think this bonus to protection marking yourself that kind of thing is going to be uh, very helpful and i would imagine that she would be able to pull off some dazzling light uh, when she's not healing she can use illumination from position three as well which i wasn't expecting uh camping skills i don't think we really need to worry about too much we have them, and that's good. He can uh, reduce stress, remove mortality de debuffs. Prevent ambush, I think, is not necessary in these places. And then, yeah, this is a good one. Uh, she's got the battle trance, which is great, and then the increase to crit for herself. Maybe instead of pep talk, we could take something like revel, even though it's not ideal. And yeah, illumination. Uh, bypassing stealth would be great, actually. So I think we will take this instead of Judgment. And then her usual healing skills, Dazzling Light for a good stun. Sounds very good. She has these as well. Increase to healing skills, debuff stun skill. Uh, increase damage for melee. 
reduced virtue chance is a little bit sad, but let's take a look. What is this? That's a ranged, and that's a ranged. So this doesn't actually help us at all. We get the debuff and stun, which this debuffs here, and that stuns. So that's helpful quite a bit. And then this uh, increased healing skills is fine. So I guess just for the sake of those three things, it's worth it. Reduce virtue chance, though, is kind of sad. But, yeah, we wouldn't be able to get another trinket combination that would be able to increase healing skills, debuff, and stun uh, with only a reduction to virtue chance. So I think we're going to have to stick with this. We might be able to do better, but I don't see how. Uh, it w it's not Eldritch that we're fighting, right? The husks and beasts and humans. So we don't need to worry about that. Stun skill, debuff skill, increased crit chance, reduce virtue, increases stress. What was the stun? Yeah, he has to be in position one or two. But that, uh, that debuff skill increase is huge. To be able to reduce their uh, dodge or protection would be basically guaranteed whenever he hits. We'll take it. That should be alright. Oh, we could do this instead for that move skill increase. Move and debuff. It reduces his HP, which I'm not thrilled about. Uh, something with... Yeah. Increase to bleed resist and max HP. That would be great, actually. So we'll drop that. So he's got 37, 44, 74, 53. All pretty good, I would say. And I think we're all set to go into the farmstead. I'm going to get rid of some negative quirks from our other characters, and we'll be uh, in the provision screen. All right. Got that all taken care of. We'll take all of those. We'll take all of those. We'll also take all of them. All of that. Oh. Why is there one less holy water, I'd like to know? Uh, we don't need any blood here. We'll take a stack of laudanum. Because I think I forgot to take it last time, and we ended up being in bad shape because of it. I can't remember for sure, though. That's been, like, more than yesterday. Um, I don't remember us needing shovels or skeleton keys. I think there is one curio uh, that you can open with a skeleton key that could potentially appear in there. But I don't think shovels are necessary at all. Yeah, shovels are not necessary at all. I don't... I don't think we've ever used this shard dust. It costs uh, shards, though, to bring them out. So I don't know if that's a good idea, since we're low on them anyway. We're kind of going into harvest. So yeah, I think this is what we're probably going to go with. Oh, I didn't realize. I didn't even see that there. Of course it's there, though, because we're taking characters that do that thing, where they add stuff to the place. You know? Know what I mean? You know? All right, let's cross our fingers and hope we can uh, get through this. We have a pretty solid team, I feel. Uh, but, yeah, let me just jinx it by saying that. All right, it plays that same cutscene all the time, and we've recently been in uh, the farmstead, so I don't know if I'll cut that out or not. We'll see. That's right. Twisted Mockery of Life. Let's kill him. Get that music playing. Get it going. I'm ready. Protection. I know he has repost, but we're gonna hit him. We'll see how we do. No, don't pop the ground. Okay, bit of stealth coming at you. You know what? We'll just set this off just because we can. And just because he just stealthed and I hate him. No, don't bend her reality. A little bit of stress coming in. Uh, uh, yeah, we'll bust this out at the very beginning. Does that have a timer on it? One battles. Okay, so that should last basically forever. Because the battles are different here. I didn't really think about what her skills were. Uh, he's not very resistant to bleed. He is resistant to blight, though. I really need to try to remember that if I can, but I usually don't. 
Seven to 14, come on, nine. Are oh, you freaking kidding me? One health he has left. Of course it is. Even though I reduced his protection and everything. Okay, this isn't the worst. Uh, we will, let's see. He also has protection, so we'll hit him with this. That's right. Uh, we can party heal. That should work. I mean, of course it works, but I mean, that should be the best that we can do for right now. Eight. Not terrible, but never the best. Let's lunge. Yep. Dodged. Wonderful. What are you gonna do now? What are you gonna do? Smote. Smitten. You bestial not scream. Ha <laughs> ha. Got him. Dead. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. One soul reaped so far. Pretty miserable, if you ask me. Let's stun this man so that he can't do anything to us this round. Ha ha, you fiend. Let's pull this man. Because I can do very little else. Uh, smite him. Are you kidding me? One health again? I feel like the this place is cursed. Where we are always doing all but one health to these guys. Size alone Dead. Does not dissuade the sharpened blade. Do a big hack. There you go. Critted. Kriya, indeed. It's one of my favorite quotes by the alien. Uh, party heals. Everybody, everybody want a little bit of healing? The flesh is knit. That was a nice uh, crit there. What are we looking at? 5, 8, 16. Take this. Take that. Nice. A madman's nightmare, that's correct. Oh, she's not in position to do her um, her thing that she does with the, with the stuff. You guys know what I'm talking about. Uh, do we want to weaken these guys or reduce their dodge? Let's make them easier to hit, I guess. Wow, 20 from that? Good grief. Maybe I do have to have a uh, Jester in this team. Because that's going to end up being a lot of stress we have to heal. And we don't get to camp every time we get a break. He's not going to be able to relieve that kind of stress. Especially not since I need him dealing damage. That's insane. You guys need to stop that. And we can't just take laudanum, right? Yeah. We have to be under the influence of horror to have that be a thing. Stun this man. He likes to uh, bother us with his madness. Did you really just miss him? Miss me with that missing people thing. Okay. Just don't do it ever again. Kidding me? Missing these people? I can't believe you! As there, the see? Falls, this is why the Hellions are the best. Blossoms. No, stop sowing seeds. Just attack me with your... with your hoe, alright? Stop doing stress damage to me. I hate you. It's annoying. It only serves to make me want to kill you more. No, don't fall your ground. I can't unstealth you anymore. Because we're in a bad positioning. Hit him, I guess. I said hit him, not miss. Uh, hit this guy. Yeah. And then we can do the zealous accusation thing. Go ahead. No, it's not that bad yet. We'll heal. Because that's just four. We should be able to heal that easy. I need to get them back into position so she can de-stealth people. But he's about to do his trample thing anyway. I guess they've always been able to heal themselves. I just didn't remember. I was hoping we could kill him this round, but it didn't work out. Obviously. Grievous injury. Palpable fear. Uh, we can't... Can't do much, really. I guess we could attack this thing, but we can't kill it with him. Then attacking this guy is kind of useless. Make him weaker, I guess. Uh, go ahead and just move this time. It'll be alright. I should... Ah, I knew he was going to trample and they were going to shuffle again. I shouldn't have done that. Breakthrough. Dodged. She didn't have much else she could do, though, really. Honestly. Uh... I kind of want to inspire her, though. We need a little bit of stress 
healing there. Yeah, nothing I could have really done about that. We do need heals, though, for him. Yeah. They're never gonna stop. Um, can we kill him with this? Possibly. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. No, don't strike my rear. Oh, stunned and bleeding. This is all very bad. Go ahead and heal him. Yep. And at least they are focusing on my tank, though. I can say that for them. Oh, it's so frustrating that that debuffs her uh, damage for two rounds as well. Maybe I should give her her ability that uh, does good for her. Gives her buffs. What other things does she have that buffs? Nothing. It's just this. Yeah, this reduces damage, as a matter of fact. This reduces damage, so it's only this that can increase damage. But at least she only has the one skill that decreases her, her stuff, so that's good. Uh, heal him again. Just directly. Yeah. Because he's correctly being targeted by the enemies. Uh, bleed this thing. It should take. Good job. Uh, how long... It's three for one more round. I'm not going to waste my bandages. We'll use them on something more important. More deadly. Oh, come on. I was hoping you would paw the ground. Oh, good job resisting this time, though. And you could try to heal him. Only as much as the Vestal was able to, though. Looks like... Oh, she, she did more. She showed him up. Good job. Proud of you. Yeah, that six is only for one round, though, and then it'll go back to three. Ouch. Three whole damage. Right? Yeah, three for two. Kill him. Two health? You gotta be kidding me. I'm so tired of that. Go ahead and try again. Eight this time. Even worse. Party heal. A momentary abatement. That's right. It sure in the heck is. No, don't sow your seed on him. Gross. We're getting very stressed out, slowly but surely. For the best scream. Uh, yeah, kill him. I said kill him. I wanted you to kill him. I really did. You were the chosen one. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Yeah, mad seeds. I said, kill him. A victory. Perhaps the turning point. Kriya is correct. You have eight that you're taking. Yeah, he's low enough on health that we need to heal him up. Uh, we can this man, or I mean, masterfully vulnerabilize him. No, don't, don't labor on me. Yeah, party heal again. Be really nice if you could uh, crit on one of those though. I kind of want to do this and see if we could kill this with it. There we go. Another abomination. Get a big heal. Cleansed from our land. Thank you. Thanks for beyond timing my space. Perfect. Corrupted curiosities. I think this is a Begging single heal. Examination. And I play favorites. I'm not gonna lie. And that's about all we can do here. Onward. How fantastic and terrible. Yeah. It's like my whole life in one sentence. Get this guy. Yeah, you think. You think you're hiding, but let me tell you something. You're not. You're not hiding at all. I have you now. Good dodge. Kill it. Oh, really? A 12? I know you can do so much better than that. Not angry, I'm just disappointed. Kill him. No, don't trample me. I want to stay in my position. Ugh. Why aren't you resisting the movement? Don't you have a trinket that specifically does that for you? Impressive. Thanks. Thanks, I've been trying my hardest all day. That's a lie. Oh. Oh. See, let's kill him. Critted. Nice. 
Uh, you're going to dazzle him? Sure. This one instead. Got him. Got him. Done. Hit him. Hit him with the goodness. Maybe I should give him his move ability, but, uh... I kind of like the skills that he's carrying right now. Because the old, um... The old one, too, really comes in handy. The zealous accusation to attack two positions at once. Always good. Uh, we'll stun him, too. That'll work. He needs to be moved forward. I'm not, um, using his time wisely. It's not the worst, though. Uh, go ahead and start on your way. He just needs to come forward one more position and we'll be all right. Maybe I'll move her back. But those stuns are really coming in handy. Okay, she's going first, so I'm moving her back so that he can do some damage. No, don't strike her rear. I've used that joke already, sorry. It's old news by now. Yep. No, not seven. I was thinking double digits at least. Come on. You're supposed to be a word reconstructor. Let's go. Uh... Yeah, bleed him. He's not gonna... Not gonna miss. Four. Kill this man. I said kill him. You didn't do it. It's not very nice. Now we're reshuffled again. Oh no, he, he's stealthing. That's right. Not anymore. Revealed. Bled. Spreading around these dots. Oh, he resisted. He's dead. Good. Good hit. I'll take that. I'll take that as a hit. Uh, make... I already removed his dodge. Make him hurt less. And us hurt more. No! So damaged. Ooh. Dead. He was already dead, but this man's closer to being dead now, which is good. Uh, let's... Let's try a heal again. There we go. That's more like it. I like that. Yeah, get so trampled. And now the shard goes way back to the back and she can't reach it, so somebody's gonna take a bunch of damage from that exploding. Because I don't think we can kill it with this. No, two to four only. We could kill him, though. Two to four. And that would be nice to have him out of the way. He'll probably turn into another shard, though. Let's start moving. Which is bad for him, but he can do some heals here. Compassion is a rarity in the fever pitch of battle. That's right. Ooh. That's so much damage, too. Jeez. Okay. Somebody let my healers go first. Okay. At least that doesn't do damage, though. I'm fine with that. Here. Have some of that. That was a surprising amount of heals, and I really appreciate it. I was dumbfounded for a second there. Party heals. I need to move them back, but we're getting there. We need to kill him so that we don't have to worry about being shuffled again. Until the next one shows up. Okay. There we go. A decisive pummeling. Killed him. I should have healed her goodies, but we'll work on it. Everybody's healing her. <laughs> She's like my only damage dealer right now. How do we get two of them? Alright, drop back. Two. Is that what we want from you? I think it has to be. Uh, yeah, go ahead and heal us all. I know. I know. Uh, take out this one, actually. I can't remember which one Executed appeared first. Purity. I think they appeared at the same time. Did the horse turn into two of these? I wasn't even paying attention. That's how into the game I am right now. My head is lost. I'm telling you. We're getting our seed sown all over us. It's really, uh, really tragic. Yeah, she does have a little bit more. I'm still playing favorites, though. I'll tell you. Oh, thank you so much for dodging that. You are the squishiest boy. So that would have been tragic if you had, uh... Had to take damage there. Uh, that's not going to hurt him very much. I think we would be better off hitting him with this. To reduce his protection there. 
I need you to stay visible, though. Because I don't know if my Hellion goes next or not. She does. She do. Go and take this. And then strike this man down. That's close enough. Because he will bleed and he will die. Uh, you're going to go ahead and reveal him. Except he's going to reveal himself next turn anyway. So that's kind of a waste. But it did a little bit of damage too. So there's that. Yeah. Seed sowed. Resisted. Uh, you need to start coming up, sir. Now move, move us back into it. Of course you did. Of course you did. Uh, we'll go ahead and move back. And then you're going to kill this man? Not quite. One health he has left, of course. We're getting rid of him. Destroy. He didn't even leave a corpse. I think he can only do a limited amount of things from this position. Oh, great. Just what I needed. Yep. So now he gets to vanish. I really need him to have the uh, ability to move around. But it's useless after this because I'm pretty sure that uh, we're going to end up fighting other enemies after this. Right? Because the color will change and we'll fight either uh, crab people. Hello? Oh. They're all vanished. Uh, yeah, so we have to pass. Can't do anything else. I could not, for the life of me, figure out why uh, she couldn't do anything. Yeah, we'll fight other enemies anyways, whenever this stuff changes, so... Being able to move isn't going to be as important. Come on, move us back. Okay. It's not the worst, but I hate it. Uh, we're going to weaken this guy. I think he was already weakened. Nope. Got his dodge removed. Here. Bleed him so we can do damage to him even when he's vanished. Uh, you're going to stay there, I think. Stun the man. We need to have him unlock. We should have healed. We need some stress taken down. Good. I have you now. Dead. The bigger the beast. The greater the glory. Stun him now. Try and vanish. I dare you, you fiend. Heal her. Wow. Good grief. That was incredible. Heal her. We're not doing terrible with the stress. Because I've been forced to use him to stress heal. But um, You know what? Drop back. Uh, go ahead and take this. Back to the That's pit. right. I don't think he can use his fighting skills from there, so this is perfect. Go ahead and smite this. Be gone, fiend. Got him. I wonder if we get shards from doing that. I mean, like, does it count those as, as extra or whatever? I don't know. Make it vulnerable. Kill him. Perfect. Aclora? I don't remember seeing that one before. I'm sure she has said it, though. We just got back into position, you you total jerk. I hate you so much. More than you'll ever know. Strike him down. Uh, start moving up, because we're way out of line here. That was the worst possible position that we could be in. Okay. Can't do much about that. We need to get her out of the front line, obviously. Because she's almost dead. Big heals. Yes. Crit 2. Incredible. I couldn't ask for better. Damage, please. It wasn't much, but it was honest work. Uh, I don't... I don't want to give him a bandage. We're doing it anyway. This is like the last fight, so this is stupid of me. I'm sorry. Yeah. Very last move. And I gave him the buff. Maybe it sticks around though. A place of refuge. Okay. If only for a fleeting moment. Let's let's drop that. 
I don't love it. I didn't even use this in the last one because we got shuffled around so much. It was kind of stupid. Uh, but we'll use it again in this, this next area. Okay. This is a party heal, I think. Yeah. Good. Voondabar. Uh, we'll move this. Okay. We're looking pretty good. We don't need to eat, actually. We still have all of our food here, which is great. 30, 23, 9, 29. Not bad. Not bad. We're ready. That's going to do it for this episode, though. If you want to catch another one, be sure to subscribe. Consider supporting my channel by becoming a member or through the Patreon link down in the video description. And feel free to check out any of my other videos or playlists that you might be interested in. Thank you so much for all the time that you spend on my channel, and I hope blessings of wisdom and peace on all of you. Farewell.